How did today go for you? It was good. It was fun. Yep. So we've had obviously like at times six guys, and this is just you by yourself. I mean, yep. What kind of situation did this feel like for you? Or are you just you out there by yourself? Uh, just had fun with it, you know, like a normal workout. Um, just excited to get out here and show the whole organization what I'm about. What did you know about the organization? I mean, everything. I know Coach Billups. Uh, I think it was his first, or second year, if I'm not mistaken. Um, got a group of young guys that dealt with some in, uh, injuries last year, um, but got a great team overall. I feel like once they get all their guys back, get healthy, get everybody back in the gym, they're gonna make a big splash in the day. Uh, just youth, energy, um, hard work. You know, um, of course they got Hall of Famers like Dame Lillard. So I, I would just come in and just try to be a piece to what they're trying to build. What position do you see yourself playing? It doesn't matter. Say it again. Sorry. What position do you see yourself playing in the NBA? Or it doesn't matter. Oh no, sir. It doesn't matter to me. I feel like I can come in and play any position that any coach needs me to play. Obviously, defensively, you're probably pretty close to where you want to be. But how do you feel like the offensive game is going? Uh, just developing, even on the defensive side. I mean, I just want to keep expanding my game and keep becoming the player I know I can be. I mean, I'm only 18 right now, so I know I got a lot to grow, a lot of room to grow, and I'm just going to keep trying to make strides. I saw you took only one three last year. Is that something that you would want to add to your game, or how do you feel about that? Um, well, that's only because we had a lot of shooters. Um, like me, I'm big on playing a role, doing anything I need to do for us to win. So, I mean, if we got three, four shooters, I'm gonna just go rebound, go play, go play D, go do what I have to do to make the team win. I mean, I don't, I'm not into trying to force shots or force points or anything. I just let everything come to me. I saw you hit a couple of threes in the corner when you came in, so this is this something obviously you can do? You just haven't been allowed to do it this year. Yeah, uh, yeah, I'll say it's something I definitely can do. Definitely been working on it a lot throughout the summer. Um, I'm capable of it, but like I said, I'm gonna keep developing, keep trying to expand my game. A uh, great teammate. I mean, I just, I'm just a guy who wants to win. So I feel like I can fit in any culture, any team, because you put me around guys who let a game and let it win. I mean, we're going to, we're going to be great together. Who else did you work that with? Uh, Detroit, Detroit Pistons, uh, a couple of days ago. Did you talk to the Blazers already, like in Chicago at the combine? Did you already kind of know that they were interested in you, or is this the first No, sir. Uh, I think my agent had talked to him and spoke to him and uh, came back to me and said that they weren't interested in. That they wanted to have me out for a workout, so that's how we got here now. What's been the difference between you know your experience at the combine, you're meeting with a million different teams like at home across one day, versus you come in, you maybe get to spend a whole day in the you know with, in one building, one facility with other people? Is it kind of a different yeah. experience? Yeah. It's a totally different experience because you get closer to the program. You get to actually see the inside of the program, meet the people who run the organization, meet the behind the scenes people. Of course, looking from the outside in, you just see the players, the coaches. But when you come in, you get to meet everybody who runs the program, makes everything flow. So I feel like it's more intimate. You get a better feel for everything, how, how it works. That's after this. Yep. With Dane? Uh, no, I never actually met him, but of course, I mean, it's Dane, so. <laughs> <laughs> you mentioned you're only 18, so you just became eligible to vote. Congratulations. <laughs> Going into the NBA season, I think you, I think you won't even be 19 yet. The season started. No, I won't. So, how do you feel you are prepared mentally, maturity wise, to handle the pressure? Because they're doing a certain thing. They're probably going to want you to maturity right away because Phoenix is next to get the playoffs. You can great handle it. Uh, I wouldn't have made this jump if I didn't feel I was ready mentally, physically, or, or skill-wise. I mean, where I'm at, I love to be challenged. Um, that's why I decided to go to college early. Um, it was a great challenge to help me develop. So where my mental is at now, I understand that I'm not trying to come in and take over and be. That's the, All that comes with growth. It comes with time. It comes with understanding. I know I understand that I have to get to the next level and develop on it first before I can make my huge run. But like you said, I mean, I'm, I'm definitely, definitely feel like I sat down with my family in my circle, and I definitely feel like that this is the right move for me. So, along with what Aaron said, like, obviously, you're, you're youthful, but, like, just coming across, you don't seem like you're 18 years old. Like, where does that maturity come from? Is it your family? Uh, yeah, I mean, I guess it's just it's all a testament to my background and my family and how I was raised. I'm definitely raised to be very independent, um, just to be mature. I, I don't know. I guess it's just my personality. Good. Yes, ma'am. Couple more guys. I'm very family oriented, so like any chance I get outside the game, of course, this process is taking up a lot of my time. 
But any little downtime I get, I like to just spend time with my family, my mom, and my siblings. Where will you be on draft? Just two? Yes, sir. Where will you be on draft night? Where will I be? Yeah. Uh, hopefully in the green room in New York. What was it like working with the Sheep It was good. It was fun. Uh, Coach Sheep is definitely like a mentor towards me, um, being from the same city, coming in, him being a big, uh, skilled big, one of the most skilled bigs that played the game. Just, just showing me a lot, teaching me a lot, giving me a lot of advice. He did a lot for me, so my time with She was great. He still to this day is one of my biggest mentors. Can you tell you anything about Portland? Uh, no, not yet. I haven't talked to him about Portland yet, but I'm pretty sure he has some stories. Yep, yep, yep. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, guys.